there is something fantastic for the naughty boy of the launches to now become the good boy of the launches. And uh, you were talking about the satellite, you said it's a game changer. Uh, in what way is it a game changer? Today you have a mobile, the cells which were built 15 years before with a certain population density, they are not able to sustain because the population has increased. And they now, and the number of users have increased, so that the per capita data rate has reduced. And that is why you get call drops, because that fellow cannot manage, so he simply stops your call. Imagine that uh, the satellite communication for India, earlier we used to illuminate the whole of India. But that, you see the electronics remains the same, the bandwidth of the electronics frequency allocated, they remain the same. So if I illuminate a bigger area, I could have been transmitting a per capita data transmission or a per square kilometer data transmission, if you say, that becomes lesser and lesser. And because the, because the bandwidth allocation is same, if I put the focus in a narrower, then a per capita data rate will be increasing. And it is like a, exactly the cellular architecture, but a, all the central antennas of the cells are shifted to satellite. Presently, we are sending at the GSAT-11. It's an operational satellite. It's a called a 32-beam satellite and a, with a 16 real beam and two polarization. This satellite will be launching in next year beginning from Kuru. But uh, that will be operational. But uh, prior to that, a half of that satellite, except the polarization diversity, so it is a one-fourth. So it is a eight real beam and a, each single polarization we have transmitted. It is covering the 60% of India and covering the almost all major minor cities and all. We are going to experiment that GSAT-11 was to be operational. Prior to that, a lot of ground technologies to be experimented. Yes. And the user has to be convinced because that the user has to now change mm. because that it's a carbon now. So what the to get to the people to user because the future is in carbon, user terminal on carbon. And they, but the user is now comfortable in cave band. So we put user terminals in cave band and the hub on carbon. But then I will tell you that uh, we are on a very steady path on a GSAT 20, which will be flying end of next year. It will be car cross car. Oh, wow. We have uh, these po possibilities. One is that the, we have a receivable terminal. So it will become a DTH, but the data rate will be more now. And because the DTH data rate will be more, now you will be able to see more number of high density channels so that the user will be graduated we we have to graduate user first from transponder to data. selective data rate requirement you know that is he, he has to graduate in a KU band you see. one question is will you also include internet in that yes for internet we have to go through a biomedia because internet means we have to transmit also because it's a bi-directional yeah. media. In that case, what we propose that uh, we will have a central receiving station with a large antenna so that itself can support a very large bandwidth. And uh, it will be centrally, it will be transmitting from this antenna. It is like, it's not a hub, it's a central transmit receive stations. And then, it will distribute the signal horizontally through Wi-Fi. Okay. Because today all smart cities are coming on a Wi-Fi. Wi yeah. Now we can take on this bandwagon. Now the Wi-Fi data rate has increased. Now it's a question of providing a backbone. One can say that uh, why not optical fiber, but that is a major city. Yeah. But uh, today if you connect even a small town, of uh, Jharkhand and an obscure village on another place, then we must have to have a rapid percolation of the backbone. 
and that backbone is possible through satellite is a much cheaper cost. Though technology is high, but the cost will be falling by the time because we'll be making everything in India. So the cost will come down significantly. So what we expect, it will provide a backbone support because it's a high debt rate capable because of a car ban, it will provide a backbone support all throughout India. Usually in internet, you know, the latency problem is solved because uh, most of the internet, uh, it is a query versus answers, where the answers are long, questions are small. So what will be, is the transmission latency will be there. But uh, then when a streaming, there will, after latency, it will be continuous. Okay. In fact, now there is a protocol set there for the latency obviously. But then obviously when there is a bidirectional transmission there, this latency has to be taken care. But uh, this latency problem, not only in space, but they don't think that even a fiber also the latency, because it has to ship from one electronics to another every step. Yes. So when you club them together, that, uh, that, that will be also very good latency will be there.